Hello my friend, welcome to my channel. Today I've got Dom Pearl and I'm going to stamp with black and white. I started off with Neltix Formula 2 and here is Dom Nail Polish. Um, it's called Pearl. It's supposed to be a white hollow but it's more gray. And here's the card from that polish. I've got my base coat on and dry already and I'm going to go in and start applying Pearl. I was really excited. I, you know, we're always on that hunt for, you know, a white hollow, which is kind of like looking for a unicorn. Um, so, uh, but this one's like a super, super light gray, and I'm not disappointed that I, I bought it. It's just not white. <laughs> Hi, Woody. How you doing? It's a beautiful, beautiful hollow, though. So there's the first coat. We're going to go in with our second coat. And the camera is not showing you how crazy hollow this is. I'm hoping at some point it will pop up here on the viewfinder so I can see how, how I'm seeing it. <laughs> Still nothing. Ugh. But there's two coats. I'm going to go in with some top coat here. This is that Fast and Hard from Vibrant Vinyls. Being sure to cap that free edge. There we go. I'll be using the Beauty Big Bang XL031 in Funky Fingers and Gesso and Funky Fingers in Dark Night. I'll be using my Bungle Monster Monocle Stamper and my Clear Jelly Scraper card. I'm going to use this image and stamp it in white. It's going to um, kind of like be a background, kind of like wrapping paper. Kind of like a fancy, a fancy wrapping paper. Very delicate looking. And I'm doing that on all of my nails. And now I'm going to go in with the black and stamp um, different Christmas images. This first one's going to be the Christmas tree. I know I've already used it, but it is one of my favorites, so I'm using it again. <laughs> and um, I don't know if you've seen my little thumb on that thumbnail on that hand, but it is way back into the quick short, so we're just not going to show it that much attention today. It's still getting painted, but um, it's it's just not you know, going to be in front of the class today. And I am going to put that Christmas tree image on all of my nails except on my ring finger. I'm going to do a different design. And the design I'm putting on my ring finger will also be the one that's on my thumb. I'm also cleaning this plate off with pure acetone and a cotton ball in between images because you want a good pickup. And here we go. I'm going to use this Merry Xmas. And I'm going to kind of, well, first I've got to get that excess off of there. And I'm kind of going to twist it just a little bit, a little diagonal. There we go. And dip back to another Christmas tree for the pinky nail. I wanted a Christmas Manny, but I wanted to use different colors. And I thought this being kind of a gray and white and black. I thought that would look really cool. Very, very pleased with it. So I'm going to go in with a piece of tape and get up some of this excess stamping polish, or not even stamping polish, this excess polish that got stamped around my finger. And some of it's coming up. Pretty happy with that. Always happy. Always happy when that works a little bit. Whether it works a little bit or a lot, I'm always happy with it. And then we're going to go in with some acetone and a cleanup brush and just clean up around the edges a little bit. I'm really liking this one though. Liked it so much I wore it for four or five days. I'm going to go over the top of the stamping with the Born Pretty Smudge Free Top Coat. And once that's dry, I'm going to go over the top of it with some posh top coat. I really like this one though. A little different, but very, very nice. 
I enjoyed it. But I would love to hear what you think about it. Leave me a comment down below. I always love chat and polish with you and you know we all get so many ideas from each other. You, you just have no idea how many ideas you guys give me. So keep them coming. <laughs> Hi Woody again. So there we go. Beautifus, beautifus. So I've got two swatch photos today. Got this one. And then a more up close one. You can see those swirls through the Christmas trees up underneath. That's kind of cool. So I want to thank you for watching. Until next time, be good to yourself.